today we are going to learn, learn another problem on pentagonal lamina with the normal type of problem so now we look at the question so pentagonal lamina of it just 25 mm so it is so we have to construct a pentagonal lamina of dimension 25 and it is resting on hp with one of its sides okay that means we have to construct a pentagon with respect to the edge on the left hand side we can now the inclinations such that the surface makes an angle of 60 degree with HP. This is what the inclination to the HP. Now, the same edge on which it rests is inclined at 45 degree to VP. Okay. So, now we have to construct with the first position now. So we know that it is in first quadrant. So we have to construct a pentagon now of dimension 25. So we know that we have to use the protector for angles. So angle it is 72 degree. Uh, at another point we have to mark it for 72 degree. Now we have to cut the angle for 25. Okay. Now from this point. After constructing it, so we can remove these parts. Now we can show the dimension on one side. Now we will draw the projection lines to construct, construct the front view. Okay. So front view it is lying here on the XY line. Okay. Now we will write the notations. So from the front view we are able to see B dash, C dash and D dash visible. But A dash and E dash not visible. Now we see that we have to make such that the surface makes an angle of 60 degree with HP. So for that we will take a reference here first. That is this B dash, A dash. Now we will be marking at an angle of 60 degree. So now here carefully we have to cut two arcs here from B dash to D dash and B dash to C dash. First arc from so B dash to D dash. That is your first arc. Now second arc from B dash to C dash. Now 
acted on the rotation this is c dash e dash and this is d dash now i'm going to dark this length Okay, now we write on the notations. So A dash and A is reaching here. B dash and B reaching here. C dash and C will be meeting here. Uh, D dash and D will be meeting here. And E dash and E, sorry, this A will be meeting here exactly. is over a dash a and this is our e. now we will join it okay. so this is the second position now Similarly, can construct the third position. So, third position angle of inclination it is 45 degree. Uh, first, uh, we are going to mark a reference point. Now, to this reference point, we will be marking at 45 degree. Okay, now we have to copy this diagram right so first i will take a reference point of a now measuring from a to b so this is b now from a to e so this a to e length it is exactly equal to b to c so we will cut one arc you can see that this b to c is exactly same so now it is reverse so remember it from a to c it is exactly equal to the b to e okay so this two lengths it is reverse this one out of it again this BC so these two points uh, nothing but here is e and this is C again we construct from C to D then okay this is what the d point now we will join all those uh, points okay so we have done with the this position now we will project it apart to construct the final position okay So this is a dash 
and similarly we have b dash here uh, c dash d dash c c dash So this is what your uh, problem. Okay. Same way, we are going to construct a normal type of problem in Pentagon using software. So go to Polygon per center, select a number of sides as five, and place it with respect to edge, and select the edge here and give the dimension 25 using smart dimension. Now place it with respect to the edge here. Now we can uh, write the namings using text command. Okay, now draw the projection line. So projection line thickness should be 0 0.13 mm. Draw the front view. Now split it. So before copying to the second position like this. Now mention the namings. So here B, C, D are visible. B dash, C dash, D dash. A dash and E dash, we should be in bracket. Can okay, I select the front view? Go to move command, creates a copy of it and slide along the line. Okay, now go to rotate command, unselect the creates copy. Okay, and give the angle 45 degree. Now go to angle between. So draw the projection line downward. So so draw projection lines straight. It should be horizontally straight and vertically straight. Okay. Now write the namings for it to construct second position top view. Guys, you just follow step by step. So the problem will become easy. You can see the problems have completed within minutes. Okay. It doesn't take too much time. So concentrate. So you have to select the arrow X mark like this. Okay. Now draw an angle line. So give the angle in minus, uh, okay, minus 45 degree. So go to select the second position top view. Select the move command. So place it with respect to the A point. Now go to rotate command and select the other end B and place it. So now draw the projection line upward to complete the final position. Guys, uh, the same type of videos I have completed in my channel. If you find this uh, video particularly useful, you can subscribe it and share it to your friends and classmates so that they can be benefited. And VTU related circulars also have updated in my particular channel, whether it is examination, revaluation, re or exam application form, results, everything it is updated. Either it can be change of college, change of branch. So all the updates you can find in this particular channel and vtu aact activity video also I have done on this you can refer i have uploaded how to prepare a video how to prepare a report everything it is provided so go to that particular video and watch it in order to complete the aact student activity points program Thank you guys. Uh, thank you for watching the video. So make sure you subscribe to this particular channel and share to your friends and classmates. Thank you all.